person calls up and he says, I don't know what's going on, but it's raining out the soffit. I'm like, raining out the soffit? Yeah, what? And then, so you have to start asking questions. So it's a conversation and, and kind of digging into what's going on. You start, well, what kind of moisture sources are in the building that would cause this? Right. And in the meantime, you're using a gas heater. Probably has the window cracked. Never mind, you know, when you combust anything, a big byproduct is water vapor. Never mind carbon dioxide, carbon dioxide, stuff that'll kill you. Right. It's got the window cracked. Yeah. Okay. It's also 10 degrees. It's also 10 degrees outside. Yeah. The ceiling wasn't finished. Gypsum board was in place. Otherwise, you can't put insulation in, but the mm. ceiling's not finished. Okay. So all of the seam, seams are open. There might have been some, the attic hatch wasn't in place. So all of that water vapor was blowing through the ceiling, condensing on the underside of the roof deck. And it could be a roof deck. It could be a concrete slab, no matter what. Hmm. And then so much moisture was condensing that it was running down the slope of the roof it was and actually out, out the soffit. Running so, down the yeah. soffit. Wow. So that's air tightness. That's a what not to do. 